Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we'll be painting a portrait of a cat. To begin with, let's start with the background. There are two things that are important when you're working on the background. One, the choice of color. Second, the texture. When it comes to color, you can either choose a complementing color or a contrasting color. In this case, I've used a complementing color that goes hand in hand with the eyes and the collar belt of the cat. I felt that in this project, this background and color choice works best. A tip here would be to vignette the background. In this way, the subject comes to the foreground and gets highlighted. Now we're going to start working on some base layers on the subject. I like to water down the colors and spread it on the desired area. In doing so, the substrate, which is the canvas in this case, absorbs the product creating a better product and substrate adhesion. With the first coat done, I now start layering with the second coat focusing mostly on the tint and tonality of the hue, which is black in this case. In order to experience the color, it is very important to understand the interplay between light and shadow. Understanding this technique not just creates a depth and feel, but also brings forth a sense of realism. I mostly take breaks between layering. This helps me come back with fresh eyes and helps me understand what I've done and what I can do better and make necessary corrections. It is very important for me to capture what I see and express what I feel during this entire process. Another tip here would be to edit the original image on your phone by using simple tools like crop, brightness, contrast, sharpness, etc. This helps with paying attention on details like the eyes, nose, and fur. Capturing the fur is the trickiest part of a pet portrait. I often zoom in and out a million times in order to capture all the details I possibly can. This is the last part where the finishing touches play a very important role. Time to work on those thin strokes that are very important to bring the portrait to life. At this point, you have to pay extra attention to the finer details here. Brush calligraphy becomes essential in fine tuning at a micro level. Lastly, capturing the eyes with the catch light adds the much needed last touch to bring the painting alive. Thanks for watching you guys. If you like the painting, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. See you soon with more videos on some interesting tips and tricks. Ciao, ciao.